Hi, another free weekly Eastern tournament. Oh, I've got 16 high cut points balance uh, opposite my partner who opened. This means yeah, this means there is a possibility of a slam hand. Mm, so I can bid two no trump. Uh, that's the Jacoby. Uh, that's jo Jacoby. Uh, it's a tad underbidded here though. Uh, because usually you do two no trump when you have a balanced hand and about 13, 14, 15 points or so. But I actually have um, 16 high cut points and probably about 17 points. So I'm a, a little bit over, I'll be underbidding a little bit if I did Jacoby. So, sixteen. Yeah. I, okay. I'll do a two diamond. Uh, is a game force two over one. Okay. So this is the other way to do it. I could have done a Jacoby, or I could do this. So when I rebid three spade like that. It means I have support for him and probably around this number of points. So it's basically an accurate description. All right. So, okay. This is a qubit saying got ace in ace diamond in uh, ace in diamonds. Rather. So, hmm. So four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. It's still possible that my partner has a minimum hand and is missing. I don't know how strong his uh spades are, right? And I only have a king of spades. So what I do is I'll bid for spade. So if my partner has something extra, then he'll probably explore slam. I've already shown him 17 points. Okay, so he's uh, so he does have something extra. So uh, I have one, two, three key cards. It's asking for kings. So I have a king of D. Okay, so it signs off in six weeks. Immediately, I've got one potential loser in hearts. If spades are split evenly, I have no losers in spades. Uh, one potential in clubs. So I have to get rid of one loser, basically. Ah, I've Yes, I actually have more than one in hearts, this tree here. Okay, so... I'm probably going to have to rub twice in hearts, or once or twice. Okay. Retain a 10 just in case I have to use it finesse. Okay, so this means probably that left hand side has run out of trumps. So that means 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Okay, I, I still don't have losers in space. Um,
but I should at least try to rough. Got another one, so that's seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay. Mm. I got the remaining trump. This cut one. Now the moment of truth. Phew. Uh for a moment, I thought I was going to down, go down one trick. <laughs> okay, so there was like a 50-50 shot here because of the iffy uh, club finesse. All right, let's move on. Well, Not everyone went to slam, and those who did four space, quite a few made uh, 12 tricks as well. So it's basically on the margin of a slam. Okay, anyway, uh, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 high cut points, but a nice uh, set of majors. It's probably an 18 point hand uh, if I get a fit somewhere. And I do have a fit, so go for it. Okay, this is an even nicer hand than I. Five, six, yeah, okay. A nicer hand than I thought. Um, okay, I'm gonna take from Dami. So I have basically one loser in clubs like that. Uh, possibly, Possibly none. Okay, the danger is opponents may be shot hard somewhere. So Hmm. Choices here. I can uh, play down this uh, diamond and then try to rough twice. Why not? I could be just being, I could just be paranoid. Yes, I was paranoid. Uh, <laughs> Okay, so rough again. Okay, and now to draw trumps. Okay, the nine came out, which is nice because my eight is now uh, promoted the same status as my jack 10. So I will take, won't bother with finesse. So that's six trumps played, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, and rough high, just in case. OK. 
Okay, one more trump, pick it up. Okay, so the last, I have one loser club, which I might as well just, yeah. The rest are mine. Okay, uh, but it could very well have been uh, a shot the shot in hearts. Given that I have eight hearts, right? So um, it was a choice between that or drawing trumps immediately. So I had to make a choice there. Okay, anyway. 16 high cut points. Mm. And relatively flat, so I will do a one no trump. Okay, minus Damon. So basically, very likely shot in one of the major suits. That's why I did it this way. So I think I'm going to just. The shortage is likely to be in the hearts, more likely. So anyway. Oh, okay. The shortage was in spades, not in hearts. But uh, thankfully, opponents let the hearts suit. So I have one, two, three, four, maybe five heart winners. Uh, Two in clubs, uh, another one in uh, diamonds, and another one in uh, spades. So I can actually afford to just run. Ah, okay. Uh, now seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Okay. Um, still okay. Discard diamonds. Okay, so I'm going to draw the ace of uh, diamonds so that at least my uh, diamond suit is established. And it's on my left hand side, so that's nice too. Okay. Okay, so now the current question is, is there any clue, no clue, uh, as to who has the queen of, uh, queen of clubs? So I think I'm going to have to play for the drop, meaning don't bother anything fancy, just take everything. Okay. Whoa, 42%. Ah, that's because heart is better as a contract. All right, never mind. That's a consequence of me, uh, my preference to bid one no trump uh, whenever uh, it seems uh, more likely. All right, uh, there's no right or wrong here, I, I think. All right, so anyway. The four hearts, yeah, right, okay. I mean, I make plus anyway, uh, so anyway. Uh, okay, 14 points, again, I can open. Uh, I know there's three passes already, so. Oh, that's interesting. So this implies my partner is a two suited hand. Now the question is, can I, should I 
proceed knowing that my partner is a past ten. That's why it, that's why this thing says six to eleven points, right? Okay. Uh, 14 points, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, <laughs> 7 losers. Uh, doesn't seem likely I can have game here. So I got three, three clubs in the side suit which are vulnerable, plus, uh, yeah, I think I will. I could raise once. The question is, should I? No, I think I'll pass. I'm quite flat, actually. OK, uh, I think it's probably the right decision. Um, okay, king is probably on my left. Uh, robot self uh, quite often leads passively, so I think the likelihood is king is on my left. So I'm going to just take this. Don't bother finessing. Because there's always a danger that east is short spades. All right, so... Eight. I'm going to. No, let's let's clear the last trap. Uh, go upstairs. I want to leave, and uh, well, it's not right. Anyway, uh, if I clear the king of spades, I need an entry on this side. So I'm going to play down here like that. Okay. Whoa, turns out I could have made. I think. Yeah. Oh, no. Sorry. Wrong frequency. Okay, good thing I passed. Did anyone make? No. Oh, okay. No one went to fall. Well, those who went to fall hearts went down. But you do have people making plus more than I did. All right. Okay, so um, 16 points. I think I'm going to do my favorite opener, one new trump. Remember when you beat one new trump, your partner has a bias towards trying to discover a major suit fit. And in this case, I have two four cutters. This is a minor transfer. Which usually means my partner is weak. So if I transfer, I may I may preclude the possibility of going three no trump. If I don't, no, I think I will transfer because I only have an ace, singleton ace here. So okay. Which would block uh, any entries to my to dummy in clubs, which might be the only entry he has. So it's safer to bid this way. Aha. Uh -huh. 
well, four Kai cut points. Okay, so uh, I'm not going to touch a hard suit because uh, it's better that op uh, the opponents lead that suit. Um, I have two losers in diamonds here and another two winners in uh, spades, assuming I'm not rough. So I have one round of spades already. There's four, five, six, seven, eight. So there's five more space out there. I think it's reasonably safe to try to discard diamonds from here. I say reasonably, but it's not certain. Huh? Which base is a bit slow today. Okay. So if I get roughed, I can over rough. If not over rough, okay, uh, like this. Okay, I can just discard loser on loser. That will mean my opponent has to play his ace of hearts, basically. Which is fine by me. The BBO seems to be a bit slow today. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. One more. Two more, sorry. Okay. It's nine tricks. I put hundred percent. Interesting. Oh, okay, that was because of my propensity to bid one more, one more trunk. So in this case, the one more trunk bid paid off. Okay. Because the, the beauty of one on trump is your partner knows how many high cut points you have. All right. Uh, that's why I like it. Anyway. Uh, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay. All right. New minor forcing. So if I had a tree space, I'll be space now, but I don't. Uh, two, then I will, I can bid two no trump or three no trump. So two no trump is for 12 to 13. Uh, three no trump is for a little bit more. All right. Uh, so, so I guess, yeah, sure. I'll just confirm with three no trump. 
Okay, I have three tricks in spades, three show winners. Two in hearts, two in clubs. So uh, I need another two. And I have a dangerous situation in uh, diamonds, which I should leave well alone and let the opponents play. Where could I make my extra tricks? My extra tricks could be in spades. Potentially two if I'm split evenly. And I should try to develop the spade suit first because my only entry into dummy is this king of clubs. All right. Uh, do I have a potential for extra tricks in hearts? Possibly, but that will require me to lose one trick first. So but ignoring this tree of heart lead because robots don't necessarily lead their longest suit. All right, so I'm going to have to try to see if I can develop extra winners in spades. Eight, nine, ten, eleven. Nope. But I could still throw up another one. So this four of spades is now a winner. Eight, nine hearts have been out, including the one that I discarded. Nine, 10, 11, 12. Okay. Unfortunately, I'm lacking. I'm going to have to hope for the diamond suit to make good. But I don't think so. Okay, I'm going to go down one trick. Oh, did I miss the fact that? Well, anyway, I'm uh, about flat, almost fifty percent. So I'm not alone. Okay, top bots were those who didn't go to game actually. Okay. Uh, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen points with a nice long. Diamonds. So right now I'm telling myself this is actually a minimum hand, but with some encouragement, I can go uh I can try for diamonds. Even if my partner doesn't have a fit, I can go fairly high. Let's see. Okay. So I can do this. But that will mean that I'm advertising myself as a 17 pointer hand. Also, can I? Not really, because I do have a single turn, but my single turn is in my partner's suit. So I need to underbid slightly. It's not a major underbid, it's a slight underbid. But three diamond will be an overbid. So two diamond. Aha. Uh -huh. <clears throat> mm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Can I invite my partner? So if my partner had, let's say, nine points. All right, so, okay, my, my partner doesn't like the no trumps either. So uh, most likely my partner is shot in a suit somewhere. Uh, wait, hang on. But then he has some spade support. Uh, sorry, diamond support. I 
it's safe for me to be, to stay at three diamond, but I could be uh, three no trump with the idea that I can make use of my long diamond suit. My partner's probably shot in either the spade suit or the club suit, actually. So once again, I'm faced with this dilemma. Do I take the risk and bid three no trump? Yes, why not? What's life without risk, right? Okay. Uh, not too terrible. I have a jack and a queen in the clubs and a nine eight. So the moment I can clear the ace of diamonds, I can run my diamond suit. Okay, I don't bother finessing here. The king of uh, spades, even uh, the likelihood is king of spades is on my left. Even then, uh, and so that will, therefore I wouldn't bother finessing, but even if it wasn't, I want to develop my diamond suit as soon as possible and I have a queen and a jack of spades here to act as stoppers. So, Interesting. Okay. Okay, so I may have a, may or may not, uh, because I'm kind of stuck here now. Uh, the robots are playing rather cleverly right now. I'm going to go down, but perhaps I only go down by one trick. Oh, oh well. Sorry, I forgot about the spades. I did say I was taking a chance, didn't I? <laughs> yes, uh, the safer choice would have been diamonds, certainly. Uh, someone made three no drum. Oh, that's because they didn't fiddle fiddle around with uh, intermediate bits, so robot let the quote unquote. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. I should have taken the finesse then, in theory, but only in hindsight. All right, so, okay, fine. Um, okay, not too good, but then uh, I still have 61% with one more board. So let's see, 6, 7, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14 high cut points. This is reverse jewelry. Okay. Uh, well, there's nothing for it, but just go straight to four hearts. Okay. Um, one diamond loser and possibly three uh, club losers. Uh, not very good. Although if the opponents don't immediately use up the, uh, we take all the club winners, I could potentially with my seven card spade suit, develop one uh, discard. So to make this hand, I have to hope 
the opponents are split uh, three, three in space. Either that, or I could try for a finesse with the nine of spades. The 10 of spades is missing, right? Okay, so. Okay, the 10 of hearts is out, so it probably means it's unbalanced trumps. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, one more. It's unbalanced, but because I have a lot of trumps, so basically means Come on, BBO. Okay, all right. So let's try. All right, just an eight, and just now there was a ten. So it's possible the jack is on my left. The I can't do anything about the diamond loser. So I don't need a lot of trumps to for my for my club. So I think I'm gonna just Let's try to observe any of these cards. Hmm. Okay, I, I think I'll just have to try it. If I want to make my four hearts, I have to, I'm forced to try finesse. And it succeeds. Very nice. Um, I'm going to discount the diamonds anyway, uh, because I can. It doesn't matter actually. Uh, yep. Come on, we are now lost board. Um, well, doesn't make much of a difference. It's, okay. There's still a potential for a rough and slab, I think, but probably very low. Nope. Okay. So I can claim. But anyway. So the key here was to look at the discards and realize there's potential for nice finesse there. All right, so uh, that's the end of this one.